Christine Sa xin kính chào quý khán thính giả và cũng xin chào đón quý vị vào chương trình The Christine Sa Show của đài truyền hình VN TV. À, kính thưa quý vị, hôm nay chúng tôi đang có mặt tại văn phòng TD Media ở thành phố Westminster, California để à, tiếp chuyện với một cô ca sĩ rất là dễ thương, rất là trẻ, à, có rất nhiều tài thưa quý vị. À, cô ấy đã xuất hiện lần đầu tiên trên sân khấu của trung tâm Văn Sơn hiện nay à, trong cuốn DVD à, Văn Sơn số 42 tại thành phố Denver, thưa quý vị. Um, ladies and gentlemen, you're watching the Christine Sa Show and I am Christine saying welcome, 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 welcome. We are back in the city of Westminster, California. We're at TD Media today so that I can speak with a very young, lovely, very cute singer. Uh, recently saw her on the stage of Vang Sung. So, no more stalling. Ladies and gentlemen, may I introduce, thưa quý vị, Christine xin giới thiệu cô ca sĩ Hoàng Thục Linh. xin gửi lời chào thân thương nhất đến quý vị đang theo dõi cái là Christine Sasho và Thục Linh cũng chào Christine. Hi Thục Linh. Thì <cười> uh, Christine xin nói là Christine rất là impressed tiếng Việt của Thục Linh thật là rành. <cười> uh, Thục Linh, recently I saw you on uh, chương trình Văn Sơn 42. Yes. And you wore this beautiful dress. You sang this beautiful song. <cười> But let's start back from the beginning. I understand you're very young. Um, can I reveal your age? Yes. <laughs> à, kính thưa quý vị, cô ca sĩ Hoàng Thục Linh năm nay 18 tuổi um, và đã bắt đầu hát từ 9 tuổi phải không? Dạ. Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so, how did that start for you? Well, um, khi nhỏ tới lớn thì Thục Linh thích, you know, like thích hát um, đàn piano and um, some way nhân dịp có cơ hội thì giống như ba cũng là uh, he's in a band, right? And then um, so I just tagged along and you know started singing. And some way, look, Quang Chin Toi Lad, I had your come down, you know, for the community and ah. you know, just for fun. <laughs> your dad is in a band? Oh, he was in a band. Like, What yeah. did he play? Um, he played the guitar. Really? Bass guitar, yeah. Wow, that's really cool. I think if my dad was in a band and was playing the bass guitar, I'd feel like <laughs> such a, you know, rock star daughter. Um, <laughs> so you started singing just back then on the stage with your dad. Mm -hmm. um, And what made you decide to, I guess, stay on stage? Well, I don't know. I guess I just love it. And um, it, there's like, it's just a, such a great feeling, you know, when you're on stage and everybody's watching you and the spotlight's on you and you're like, oh, it just feels, I don't know, glorified in a way. <laughs> and I don't know, it just got addicted. <laughs> and so I just want to sing and sing. <laughs> Uh, Linh có nhớ cảm giác đầu tiên của uh, của của Linh lúc mà Linh lên sân khấu nhỉ? Lần đầu tiên đó có còn nhớ cái phiên lần đó không? When I was nine. Yeah. Let's see. Um, có rung không? Cũng rung lắm. I uh, I had to sing in Vietnamese. Uh, lúc đó thì tôi vẫn hát uh, bài Hai mươi bốn mươi. And um, ah. I remember <laughs> my mom. Uh, she she like dressed me up and she made me wear pigtails and I was all young and <laughs> and I sang it and that was like my first Vietnamese song. Ah. And um, it was twist, so I had to dance to it too. So I don't know. I made the audience laugh, <laughs> and so I, I don't know. I got addicted, and I guess they liked it. <laughs> can, can we have a taste of what that sounds like right now? Like, how, <laughs> <laughs> I'm putting you on the spot. Do you remember the song at all? To sing it? Mm -hmm. um, it goes, Nam anh hai mươi, em mới sinh ra đời. Ngày anh bốn mươi, em mới vừa đôi mươi. Tình đời nhiều lúc mía mai, cuộc đời nhiều đắng nhiều cây vui đó sau đây. Wow, cảm ơn Linh rất nhiều. <cười> thưa quý vị, Christine thật là ngạc nhiên, một cô bé, cô bé trẻ mà <cười> ngồi đây chút xíu à, thưa quý vị. Và cái một 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 cái giọng hát thật là vĩ đại. Where does that voice come from? Really, I guess when I was a little kid, I sounded like a little kid. <cười> and then, but um, my mom and dad like helped me, and like as I sang more and more, đi hát càng nhiều xong rồi cho nên cái giọng mới bắt đầu like developing mm -hmm. yeah and then um, I started to taking I started taking vocal lessons mm -hmm. and that helped a lot where were you born I was born in Malaysia <laughs> in Malaysia yeah and um, when did you move from there to Arizona is where you are right now um yeah well I live in Arizona right now but um, I used to live in Michigan for like 12 13 years yeah so you came to the states when you're how old um 18 months 18 months. Yeah. But your Vietnamese is impeccable. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's
so so. <laughs> um, can you tell us what you do to? Do you practice? Do you? Um, are there classes that you take? What, what do you do for Vietnamese? Um, um, thực linh thì hồi nhỏ tới lớn thì được ba mẹ giống như nói chuyện bắt nói chuyện tiếng Việt thôi chứ không có được nói tiếng Anh nó không bị đánh đòn. <laughs> like my brothers too, but um, yeah. But no, I never took any classes. So. À, well, hơn hơn là Christine không có đánh đòn nếu mà nếu mà thực linh không nói tiếng Việt vì tiếng Việt của Christine cũng chỉ có bao nhiêu đó thôi. Thực um, sự thật là như đó. Nhưng mà lúc mà lúc mà hát Christine biết vì lúc mà Christine cũng cố gắng hát bằng yeah. tiếng Việt thì có có rất nhiều cái cái um, cái style mà mình phải biết cách. In the in the pronunciation, it's it's very uh, what's the word? Um, it's very detailed. So, uh, do your parents help you in the studio, or is there someone to help you coach you? Um, well, I used to sing like before. I used to, I, I used to love singing karaoke, and um, in Vietnamese, so I had to like read it mm -hmm. and pronounce it, and then my parents would help me. And um, also, I had like a, I took a couple of lessons here in California um, to help my uh, Vietnamese get better. So, yeah. So maybe that's a piece of advice for our young, <laughs> our young viewers. If you need to practice your Vietnamese karaoke a lot, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's helped me as well. Um, so you've done all that on the stage, and I know that before, before you were on Vang Sung, uh, I'm aware that you were singing uh, across country, is that right? Outside of Arizona as well, right? Yeah. So how, how did you come about these opportunities? Well, I guess it's f thanks to like um, a lot of people that we knew, and um, I started singing with Adam Ho, and um, he, we sang, like, we did shows together, together <laughs> wow <laughs> and then <laughs> so we like we did like um casino gigs and yeah casino gigs yeah um cho Christine xin phép hỏi Linh mười mười mấy tuổi Linh mới bước vào một một cái casino là no it was just like this past year a couple of years that I started doing casinos. Was that strange for you? Because I didn't walk into a casino until I was 21. Oh, so. yeah. mm -hmm. No, well, I, I don't gamble or anything. <laughs> I just, you know, when I go sing, I just kind of stay in the hotel and just wait until I had, have to sing, and then I just go straight to the stage. Mm. Yeah. Wow, she she is the image of a perfect good girl, which makes me kind of want to poke at you a little <laughs> bit. No. <laughs> no, just sing chào chút thôi. Christine, đây ý là Linh hát nhạc nhạc tình rất là hay. Những, những bài bài ca mà về tình yêu thì Thục Linh có thể chia sẻ cho chúng tôi biết là có bao giờ yêu chưa? Có biết tình yêu là gì chưa? <cười> dạ chưa. <cười> no? No, I just, um, I guess I watch a lot of movies and I just hear my friends like um, tell me about their love life and I guess I kind of feel it and I try to project it in my own kind of way. Mm -hmm. I like think about it, I guess. About movies and stories that yeah. you've heard. Um, favorite movie then? Favorite movie? Mm -hmm. um, that would have to be The Pianist. It was more about like um, a war, the war, and this guy's a love for music and the piano. And mm -hmm. it was really emotional because it made me cry at the end because he was able to like at the end like he went through all these years um, without like playing the piano and it through all these hardships in the war and finally at the end he was able to like feel the piano and it made me like really emotional. Speaking of, okay, <laughs> let's let let's talk about that. I read your bio. It says that you play piano, you play violin, you write songs. My goodness. <laughs> um, tell us about piano first. What was your experience with meeting a piano? Um, I was very amazed that it made a sound. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Um, I started playing the piano when I was around nine, oh, eight, nine. When I started singing, and I guess. Um, I guess it made me like love singing more, mm -hmm. and I was able to feel um, through singing and playing the piano. So I just started writing songs, and I don't know, it's just awesome. <laughs> really? Uh, yeah. Quickly, what kind of songs do you write? Um, well, I write all kinds of songs. I don't know, like um, I guess mostly love songs. Do you think you'll be able to give us a taste of that after the commercial break? Of one of the songs I wrote. Mm -hmm. 
Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> well, we will see if that's true. Um, we need to take a short commercial break. Lynn, stay with us. Uh, kính thưa quý vị và các bạn, chúng tôi xin ngừng chương trình cho một vài phần thông tin thương mại. Nhưng sau đây, thưa quý vị, uh, Christine xin phép được trình chiếu uh, uh, phần trình diễn của cô Hoàng Thục Linh uh, trên uh, sân khấu của Trung tâm Văn Sơn. Thưa quý vị, đừng đổi đài truyền hình nha. We will be right back. Don't change that channel. This is the Christine Sang Show.